creating a mirror for your scene in Blender is actually quite easy. So uh, let's start off by adding a plane, which we'll use as the mirror. And then I'm going to press R, Y, then 90 to rotate it 90 degrees on the Y axis. And then I'm going to press G, then X to uh, grab it on the X axis. And then G, then Z to grab it on the uh, Z axis. And then you can also press uh, S and then Y to uh, scale it down on the Y axis. And then let's go into rendered view and we can add the mirror material. So add a new material and then let's go into uh, classy. And then I'll set the roughness to zero. And as you can see, we have the mirror. Okay, so now we can also add the frame of the mirror. So uh, let's go back to uh, solid view. And by adding a cube and some simple modifiers, we can create a very simple frame. So press Shift A and add a cube. And then press S to scale it down. And then press G, then set to move it on the X and Y axis. And then G to grab. And then S to scale. And then I'm going to scale it on the Z axis. So press S, then set to scale it on the Z axis and then press S and then shift set to scale it only on the X and Y axis. Okay, so now we have the frame on uh, this side and then we can use a uh, mirror modifier to uh, duplicate it to the other side as well. So uh, let's uh, select the mirror as the mirror object and mirror it on the Y axis. Okay. And uh, then next, we can add the material to the frame as well. So uh, let's make it a, a bit darker. So something like this. And then we can duplicate the frames on the side. And then press R, X, then 90 to rotate them on the X axis. And then let's change the mirroring to the X axis. And then we can press G, then set to uh, grab them on the uh, set axis. Okay. And then I'm going to grab them on the Y axis, G, then Y. And then I'm also going to scale them down on the Y axis. And uh, I think this looks fine. You can uh, fix the uh, details later. Let's go into Red View hide the overlay and as you can see it looks great. I hope you learned something and uh, more tutorials coming very soon.